Don's message of customer centricity resonates worldwide. Don has spoken across the globe in more than 30 countries on six continents. The Times of London has listed Don among their top 50 business brains. Accenture has included him in their global list of the top 100 business intellectuals. The UK's Chartered Institute for Marketing included Don in its listing of the 50 most influential thinkers in marketing and business today. In the very near future, every business in business is going to have to allow customers to review the products that they sell for the benefit of other customers. You know why? Because customers demand it and because the technology is inevitable anyway. It's like a freight train coming down the track right at you. You have a choice. You can stand on the track or you can try to get on the train, but the train isn't going to stop. With co-author Dr. Martha Rogers, Don has produced a series of international best-selling books which have sold well over a million copies and have been translated into 18 languages. Their latest book, Extreme Trust, explains honesty as a competitive advantage and focuses on the importance of trustability across every industry as the foundation for their bottom-up solution for managing interactive customer relationships. Because they protected my interest, I trust them. In fact, Amazon gave up the small profit they were going to make on the sale of this book in return for something much more important to the business. My trust. They got my trust. And that is the future of business. Don's compelling, clear, and concise way of articulating his insight places him in high demand as a speaker. Don is regularly sought by Fortune 500 executives and entrepreneurs. What's really going to be important is that you proactively look out for the interests of a customer. You proactively protect the customer from making a mistake, from overlooking a, an item. You actively protect the customer's own interest. We call that proactive trustworthiness or trustability. There is a random aspect to innovation because innovation proceeds by trial and error. Do you know why they call WD-40 WD-40? Well, maybe you know because um, it's kind of obvious from what I'm saying, but because the first 39 water displacement formulas designed by the Rocket Chemical Company in 1953 were failures. The 40th one had a lab name, WD-40. They just kept that on the bottle when they sold it at the store. Together, Don Peppers and Dr. Martha Rogers started the customer evolution. Today, they are reinventing it. Global business forces, disruptive technologies, and empowered consumers are redefining how to achieve business success today. And Don and Martha are leading the way.